Hi, what's up you guys? It's your girl Toya Yvette here and I'm coming to you with a, it's not a DUI or it's not a, well it's sort of an unboxing, but I'm getting a new dog tomorrow. I am getting me an emotional support animal because I am, I suffer with bad anxiety and depression, but my anxiety is a little bit worse than my depression. So I'm getting an emotional support animal and I am getting a dog and I'm getting him tomorrow I'm naming him Jackson I'm so excited and yeah he's a um, Jack Russell Terrier and a rat terrier mixed and my co-worker just so happened to have puppies because her dog had just had but well she ain't just had puppies because his birthday is April 22nd and today is June 10th so he comes home tomorrow but i am about to put together his crate and i'm a little nervous because i got a um size 22 inches and i think it's well he's still a puppy right now so i can always upgrade so i can have something for now because when i go to work at night i don't want him to be like roam the house scared so i'm just gonna crate train him for now even though he's going to be a free running puppy eventually. But I am about to put this together. And maybe I need to put you guys in a spot so y'all can see putting this together. Because, yeah. I don't know what I'm going to prop y'all up on. I don't know if that's going to work. Sorry if y'all get motion sickness. I'm trying to prop y'all up. If it falls, my bad. But it comes with so like warning and stuff. And this is the gate. And I'm like specially good at making stuff. So they said it's simple. And y'all still can't see. They said it's simple. So we about to see again on this like special ed it'll probably help if I get the instructions out right y'all if I can't do this video guess what y'all won't see this video <laughs> okay I finally found it Okay, so basically, I, I'm assuming it just unfolds, possibly. I don't know if I just took that off and wasn't supposed to, but I think I was supposed to. Let me look at these instructions, because I don't know if people do not look at instructions. Just do it yourself. Yeah, I don't think I was supposed to take this out. But this is the divider, so yeah, I think I'm good. So it say you open it up. Oh, yeah, this is real simple. And you do it like so. Or you hinge this on top. So it comes with the okay, yeah. Because I have to, my friend, my coworker is bringing him to work tomorrow. So I have to bring this to work tomorrow. Yeah, this was simple. Simple and easy. So basically, oh shoot. Basically, what I did, right, was, maybe if I move that a little closer. I just opened it up and you just hook it up, well, hook the hinges on the thing. Y'all falling back. Basically, just hook the hinges. I'm doing it with one hand, y'all. Ow, ow, ow. Ow. I'm hurting myself trying to show y'all. But this is the crate. I literally just almost took my nail off. And 
that's the back that's the front and it do have a divider but he a small puppy right now he's a baby so i'm just gonna open it up and this is the handle that i'm about to put on but yeah i'm so excited about getting my new puppy I got him some um, essentials because right now he don't have everything that I want him to have, but he got everything that he's going to need. Excuse my hand in the frame. That's my lighting right there. So, anywho, he got everything out. Um, Y'all, yeah, excuse my bed. <laughs> that I need for him to have right now, like food, dog treats collar, play toys, puppy hats. I um the food of choice that I chose for him is blue buffalo and it's the puppy um I really hurt my finger y'all. It's the blue buffalo and it's the um what you call her? What did that go to? Oh that's probably the hook the divider on. It's the um chicken and rice. I think it is. Yeah. Let me go get it real quick. So, yeah. This is the cat that I got him for now. Well. And I did this on research because I know dry food is like crap. And yeah, it's, it's like a lot of not so good things about dry food. Because a lot of people make their dog food. But I'm not like that crafty that I have the time to do all that because I do work and stuff so yeah I'm not gonna commit to that but so I um looked up some good food for him and this was like number five on the list and they sell it at Walmart so everybody has a Walmart everywhere you go you can always get to a Walmart so as long as you know what I'm saying they have it in abundance I didn't want to get no like rare brand food that you only have to go to a specific store to get and it's the arm and the leg like no so I got him that kind. And I also got him this collar. Because like I said, he's a puppy right now. And I got him this leash. I'm going to get him a harness because I really want him a harness. And I think it's better instead of, because you know with puppies, they like to venture off and stuff. And I think it's more control with the harness. So I'm going to go pick that up later on today. And I got him this little tug of war type of thing because you know dogs like that and I got him a little teddy bear because he needs a little fuzzy a little fuzzy friend I got him some um dental bones and a chicken flavor and a extra small so for his little teeth because I'm trying hopefully he don't like find a liking to my cords and just chew up my cords I mean I know puppies teeth so I try to put all my cords up and stuff so yeah, pray for me, y'all. And then I got him this little doggy bed for now until he get a little older. And then, of course, I'll upgrade everything. But right now, they don't need that much space. And I'm so excited about my pup. Like, I go get him tomorrow. My friend bringing him to work. We work opposite shifts. I work night shift. She work day shift. So when I'm leaving, I can just get him and go home. So I'm so excited about my new puppy and like I said I named, I'm naming him Jackson and of course tomorrow I'm going to put up another video about Jackson but this is the crate and I think it'll be good enough for him for right now until he gets a little bigger and we can always upgrade so but that's my video and my introduction on Jackson. I will come back tomorrow so you guys can see him and I can formally introduce you guys to him. And we can watch him grow up and become a great, decent doggy. Because, yeah, I'm going to spoil this dog rod. Now, I got him a, um, like one of those carriers that people carry their baby, like in the front. Y'all know I'm overdoing it. Y'all, I was looking at strollers. I'm like, you know what? I'm not going to be that dog mom. I'm not. <laughs> Like, I will not be that dog mom to have a stroller for this pooch. So, yeah, I didn't go that far, y'all. But I looked at it, though. <laughs>
But I'm so excited about my new baby, my new emotional support animal, because, yes, I need something to, like, help me cope. And I know me loving this animal and taking care of this animal and him being my baby will be awesome sauce. So, y'all, thank you all for watching. Have a blessed day. Stay safe out there. Wear your mask. Wash your hands. Because COVID is not gone. I know people are opening up and people have been opening up. But just be safe. Because I work in the medical field. It's not gone. And y'all probably see my screen save on my TV. Because <laughs> it just popped up. I'm like, what was that? But, yeah, be safe out there for real, for real, y'all. And I love you all. And I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.